There. I now start yeah, the video. Welcome What's up, back. Homies? Yeah, welcome or welcome back to more Terraria modded Thorium Ooh. Calamity. Blah 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 blah. <clears throat> His relic. Fucking... Oh, this is the guy that houses all the cool fucking shit. His, all of his items have like cool glowy particle effect. What the Slayer of Gods or the Astrum Deus? Oh, or no, 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 the slime after Astrum Deus. Yeah, Cosmolite slime, uh, or whatever the hell it's called. Where are you at? Oh, grab the platform Astrum. right there. That's the wrong place. We haven't even, yeah, there's a lot of places we haven't even explored yet. See, that just, that just tells me boss room right there. That I've made boss. several boss rooms, by the way. No, I know. I'm just looking at the bottom of the dungeon. It just screams boss room to me. It's probably where we go to fight the poltergeist. Would not doubt it. Alright, let's go. Nobody wherever you are. Uh, perform a night. Can't tell what's day or night because biome. It is daytime, nighttime. God damn it! I keep getting eyes in my inventory because you keep killing stuff, and I still can't teleport home. Don't know why I can't. <clears throat> Ooh, astral sight. Did you already get this? Yeah, it's. I don't know what I just killed. It was some kind of squirrel. What the fuck is that? Spawning oh. boss. Worm boss, my favorite. I can't deal a lot of damage Ooh, though because. Oh, I think this is when he had to take his ass. I think. Is it his ass or his head? I think it's his ass. I think it kind of, uh, it goes between. Fuck, I don't care. I'm doing body damage. Rage goes hard. I'm causing him to lag a lot though. Cause me to lag a lot. Oh my god! There's a second one? Or no, he just phases in and out, I guess. Yeah, now he's basically a ghost. I think there will be a second one though. I'm about to die. He's split in half for me. Yeah, he's a bugger. Or, well, yeah, yeah. There's a blue one of him and there's a red one of him. I'm dead. Oh, it's catching up. <laughs> dead for, or, oh, there's the him. blue! Yeah, one's uh, one can't take damage and one will take damage. I believe that's how it functions. Five seconds. Uh, excuse me. Uh, I am the worm slayer. He slays worms. The worm tamer. He got that uh, nickname back in uh, <sighs> summer school. They don't die. Okay. <laughs> Cause I'm about to. Yeah, let me use a vampire knife. Yeah, I'm about to as well. For a bit. The lag is going hard right now. Yeah, it just phased directly into me. No, I died. It's fast. You're still alive for me. It's doing that fast. <laughs> yeah, forward the, time. the lag is real. Yeah. Uh, ten seconds. He finally died. Five, four, three. about them being giant worms, they're very easy to hit with vampire knives. Yes, should not die. Alright, using rage again. Cause more lag, I'm sure. That's okay, just kill. One's dead. There, he's dead. Where's the... He's dead? Yeah, oh. they're dead. I just he's slurped dead? up all their items, I'll wait for you to grab it for me. Yeah, I got it. They also dropped 200 healing potion thing. Nice. Summon deadly abundant slime. Consumes all of remaining minion slots. Minion <laughs> must be used from the hot bar. Increase power and size based on number of minion slots. Minion. Holding this weapon grants 10% increased jump speed. Okay, there Cast there. down from the heavens in disgust. This relic sings a song. Quiet tragedy. Holy! <laughs> Whoa! I already have this weapon. Fake reactions be like. 
Well, I saw 319 rage damage, and I was like, damn! And then I shot it, and I was like, oh yeah, this I have shit. the Star Splitter, the ranged weapon. I, do not I have not opened my bag yet. I really hope it's the melee weapon. I, think I mean, if you have go. the only ranged weapon, then I can just convert it into the, range, the melee if you I want. I gave you the range. I don't know if it's the only range you can check. Uh... uh <clears throat> Uh, there is one melee, one range. So yeah, yo -yo. do you want to just turn it into the melee? Yeah, it's a yo-yo, but I think it is a good yo-yo. There you go. Bag is in the thing. Don't tell us the yo-yo called. Uh, and he started yoing the microwave. Fires a chain of comets. Fires a bigger, more powerful comet every four rounds. Ooh, the star stuff. I remember this. I star remember sputter. this weapon. Where is my unlimited? Oh, I'm dumb. Range weapon. I remember. Star. Unlimited fallen stars. I might have to go yo yo for a little bit just because of this yo yo. If it's still as good, good as I remember it to be, it was pretty Do you have dummy out? No, I do not. I don't have dummy at all. Alright. I gotta grab my yo yo bag though. To test you started going. I'll put away my elementals as well. I love the noise it makes. About 7,000 damage, that's pretty good. This weapon sucks. Really good range, that's what makes it good. But it's consistent. <laughs> Do you want the dummy back out? <laughs> yeah, well. Can you hear the huh. noise this makes? Yeah. Yeah, that's why it's called the microwave. Like, oh, it is like a microwave, isn't it? I was just about to say microwave. Dummy. The hum of the mic. Got me in waves. There's not enough yo-yo so is... stuff. Thinking about it. What is it? Uh, I mean, there's a... It's like a yo-yo bag. That's like all. That's like the only yo-yo Ash... specific thing. Astral bar is correct, is what we just unlocked. Yeah, we gotta go mine it though. And that is in the astral biome that we're always seeing everywhere? Yeah. Just making sure. Uh, I did get the hide of Astrum Deus, taking damage from inflicting true melee strikes. Drops an immense amount of astral stars from the sky, taking damage. Boosts true melee damage by 50% by boost duration. is based on the amount of damage you took. The higher the damage, the longer the boost. Provides immunity to astral infection, cursed inferno on fire, and frost burn debuffs. Enemies take damage when they hit you and are inflicted with astral infection debuff. I might have to have this instead of my elementals, honestly. <clears throat> um, what do I do with the yo-yo bag? Perfect without. No, I can only do it. The Berserker Soul. It's lame. But the want moment. Oh, yes, tummy hurts from not eating anything. Moment. How much does this actually deal, though? Like, if I don't have my yo-yo bag, is it actually worth the shit? It's pretty low damage. It's a beautifully horrible noise, and I <laughs> probably start to use it. Beautifully horrible noise. Yeah, <laughs> it's just constant. Uh, uh, yeah, we'll see. Uh, astral ore is what we need. Or... I am busy mining it. I'm up to 450 right now. Before whatever the fuck is killing me kills me. More inflicting true melee drops an immense amount of stars. So actually, is that true melee? That is not. Well, I think true melee is a global thing, even if it doesn't say it deals true melee. True melee just means I hit them. Seem to be the case for that one. 
True Melee, the class that my drunken father has mastered. How to incriminate your family speedrun. <laughs> 25,000 Just kidding, DPS. guys. Not drunk. 27,000 DPS. 27,000 DPS? 30, that sounds pretty good. 31,000. 32,000. A lot better than my high three. <laughs> Guess which weapon I'm using. The fucking old one. Yep. <laughs> I just have a new weapon that deals more, or a new item that deals more true melee damage. I love it. This is true melee, isn't it? Yeah, this is true melee. Although it doesn't work with this thing that says it does true melee damage. How many of this shit do I need? How many of these sheet? I'm at 930 or. That should be good. Astral. Astral bar. We need. God. Yeah. It's funny because he's sitting there waiting for me to throw him in to turn him into ore, but I just won't throw it in. There you go. Okay, 210 astro bars. Uh, I can finally make my def my deific amulet. Astral. Amulet. Astral bars. Not here. I already turned all the ore into bars. Gotcha. Uh, the armor is. I think the armor is a global armor, but it's mostly buffs. Yeah, treasure and ore detection, danger detection, mana and max. Now life. note, he was the last one, unless you want to do the slime until Moon Lord. Yeah, I'll do everything. Moon Lord, probably this episode. Oh, you can make a, you can make an armor set. The corpse. Yeah, the lunar corpse. Yeah, the the lunar master corpse. chief. Yeah. Uh, ethereal core. That's mana. Stop yeah, over. you know, it says that, but it's actually pretty shit, because it's a donor item, so I'm not going to do that, unless we just want the cosmetic for it. It probably makes you deal a lot of additional damage. There's no reason you shouldn't craft it, honestly. The crafting materials are dick cheap. Meta Nova. Ooh, Let's go ahead and make it. Go check it. Make a better pickaxe. Yeah, well, very, very um, cheaply. The astral pickaxe. I'm gonna make mine. 220. Astral. Yeah, it's 10% more than Pixar. I'll make it and then throw it. Here, I threw it out. I picked it up immediately. <laughs> I thought you were here right on top of me, so I figured you'd grab it, not me. Astral Blade, Astral Pike. Devastation. Astral bow. Oh yes, the astral bow. And the astral blaster. Know. Yeah. I'll make all the astral stuff to see if it's worth a shit. Inside the astral scythe. Ass. I can finally make the true biome blade. Yay! It's probably gonna be dog nice. shit. It always is. Mm -hmm. Uh, what was the master chief donor item? Corp. Ah. Lunic Corp. Corpse. True Biome Blade. Core of Calamity. True Biome Blade. Here I have it. Still gotta test it though. This Cell is sticks. Master Chief Head. We need the Night Vision Helmet. Uh, that you get yeah. Biome. Yeah, I got one of them because I had to make the set for it, but... If we had killed the Mar- Oh, we, have, we killed the Martians. Let's go buy it from the sideboard. The Night Vision Helmet? Yeah. So by Cyborg after Martians. Well, that's everything other than the Metanova bars. And uh, we can't make it, I don't think, because Metanova or and Astral Jelly. That's a really cool looking text. Yeah, see, that? Yeah, that's what I was talking about. It's very snazzy. I want to make a star core because it's something we're going to need to spawn a boss. Just not right now. Never mind, we need more Stardust. Not what I wanted to do. I can do that. I can finally do that again. Awesome. Wasn't letting me earlier. <clears throat> cyborg over in the ice. Yeah, cyborg's over in the ice. Okay. It's not 
not bad. Deals more damage the more life an enemy has left. Hmm. Huh. Pistol sucky. Uh, summons astral star swarms on critical hit. Bow suck major. God pain. damn. Okay. Good. Really good. Is it true melee? What? <laughs> it is true melee. That's and you're pro progressing? I finally found a weapon better than my other weapon. What the fuck am I buying? Night vision helmet. That's awesome. Oh, let's check the true biome blade. But it's hey, as long as it makes the moon lord easier, I'm not fucking complaining. That's a regular biome. It says, there's nothing yet uh, holding down. Uh, can I? Do I have to have lunatic core? Loom, whatever the fuck or Galaxia, yeah. Oh, a Cosmolite, yeah. I gotta kill the fucking Devourer of Gods first. Pressing right click for a shorter period of time switches your active and passive attunements. Holding down right click for two seconds attunes the weapon to the power of the surrounding biome. Uh, set bonus. Finish the fight. Projects a bubble shield that absorbs up to 50 damage. Shield starts recharging 5 seconds after being hit. Recharging from 0 takes 2 seconds. Being hit again while recharging restarts the charge timer. 10% bullet damage. Specialized range damage. These are launchers, right. dark guns, or anything else that doesn't shoot. Yep, pretty shit. I need to check every biome in the game to see which one's the best biome for this sword. And since it's a donor item, I'm sorry, but I am going to throw it on a thing, just so we can see Master Chief. Okay, that's not bad, but uh, like I said, I need to go check biomes. I will check snow biome first. What are you looking for? Uh, this sword changes its ability depending on the biome that it activates its ability in. Hmm. It's a true biome blade. You left the dummy here. Yeah, they're coming back to test its abilities. Oh. Whoa. That was cool. What the fuck? That was fucking cool. Astral? Uh... Well, it was supposed to be Snow Biome, but I guess it ended up hitting an Astral Biome. That looks Astral. It's supposed to be That's Snow very Biome. much Astral. It's supposed to be a Snow Biome. Let me go higher up in the Snow Biome. Get away from the rest of the Astral shit. Cool. Uh... Mm. Pure... Astragaldon. What do you drop, brother? The Astral Lash. Uh, 500 damage. Scythe of the Abandoned God. Rotates, summoning several balls of homing goo and decelerates to unleash Holy a storm shit. of otherworldly thunder. This is this is the snow biome, Cody. Are you in visual range? See the dummy? Yeah. <laughs> what, it just bounces back and forth? Oh, you can't see all the tiny little claw blades coming out? No, I just see it Aww. doing a little uh, flame thing. The damage isn't that good, but it's pretty cool. It's like I still think that one's pretty cool. I can combine passives, so like I can get a primary passive and a secondary passive. What is the cavern? Let's see cavern. Purple. Hmm. I just want the treasure pod. I want to know what's in the treasure pod. Yeah. Fizzled. Why did it fizzle? Fizzle, fizzle. Swordsman's pride. Like, now that's just the default. Okay, so basic generic biomes that have no actual biome, like underground and. Oh, that's forest. a flawless drop. We'd have to kill him without taking damage. Who? I think. Astrum Deus? No, the Astrogeldon. The boss after Astrum Deus. If we, if we can flawless it, then he drops the, the Scythe of the Abandoned God that does a flat 500 damage, 20% crit strike. It's not any specific damage, too. It's just damage. Not range, not melee, not rogue. Oh, this holds me in place. That's weird. Blink, 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 blink. For me, oh. you're bouncing up and down. Yeah, well, like, I, I wasn't actually flying, I was just letting it do that. Here, there was some kind of special thing. I let it hit max tier, and I do this. And I just throw oh, some cool. blade. Looks uh, like, uh, something from Empress. Let's go... jungle. Underground jungle. Still purple. Why are you still purple? Alright, so what can I do? Hmm... 
Vortex Popper, maybe? Fizzled. Can you deactivate, please? Holding left click limit, Molten Blades. But that's the same thing you did earlier. I already got that. They like take you off. How do I fucking wipe your thing? It says pressing right click with a shorter period of time will switch between your active and passive attunements around. Holding down right click for two seconds to the power of the surrounding biome. I am in the jungle. Give me jungle stuff. Was the astral armor any good? Uh, I didn't make it because it wasn't. Max mana, max life. Yeah. Kind of ass. Danger it's just detection. a global thing. It's not like good. It just has high defense, that's all. Okay, let's try the that's ocean. Sulfuric biome. Let's try that. Ooh. That's not even <clears> try space. This is the hollow. Fuck it, I'll get the hollow. Um, deficit amulet, infected jewel, for insignia, void of extinction we should be able to make. Why did that extinction here? Critical strikes explode, causing nearby enemies with brimstone. Uh, I think Abaddon. my teleporter's fucked up again. Because this is supposed to be sulfuric ocean, it's the hollowed biome. Uh, I hate wiring in this fucking stupid ass game. Okay, I'll use my goddamn shell phone. Angel treads. The absorber. What was that? Ambrosia? Why do I feel like I remember that? Okay, this game does not seem to differentiate between most of the biomes for some reason. To hell I go. I have my spawn point. I would switch out my sword for this, my shield for this. Living dude. Lots of these kind of suck. How do you get living dude? We're gonna make it. To space. You might want to make one of these. What's it the called? Ambrosial Amp. Plus 70 life, grants 2, plus 2, to plus 6, heart, uh, HP per second, life regen based on missing health. Provides life regeneration equivalent to standing in honey. Standing still grants extremely powerful regen. Halves how long you are afflicted with fire and sickness debuffs. You emit yellow light if visibility is negative. It's like a heavy heal. Hmm. Okay, well, it seems most of these biomes suck ass, which is unfortunate. I actually keep forgetting about not using my uh, my little mount thing that's supposed to do special stuff for me. Uh, Astro Bar. I didn't even get to see what else I can make with the Astro Bar. Uh, nothing. Cool. Good to know. Good to know. This gun? No, it wasn't this one. It was the other one. New can we do anything with the... I think I did that boss with the wrong thing on. Um... You <laughs> should have every fucking boss. <laughs> That's what makes the gameplay so much better, is because we do it, and I'm just lacking. <laughs> if I can do it, you can do it, folks. If you can have Maybe a person that's as strong as me around, you can do it. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Someone that eats all the damage, like me. Sometimes, yeah. Sometimes? All Bruh. the time. Yeah, all the time. I'm always eating damage. Oh, my fault melee is overpowered. It's just melee is just aggro based. Like they couldn't make a melee any weaker, or we would just be dog shit and want to choose it. <laughs> Excuse me. Okay. Uh, astragalium. Uh, astral communicator in the uh, astral. Unless astrum is killed beforehand, this item will no longer function. When the moon lord is slain. So we have to kill him before the moon lord. Astral commute. Okay, function. where the fuck do you get it? Non consumable. Summon astral mission effects. Yeah, it doesn't tell you where you get it though. Time to Google. Terraria. Astral communicator. Astral communicator. Catalyst mod. Official Terraria. 
Astro needs a harm item used to summon da, 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 da. the Astragalum Super Boss. It can be used any time of day in Astral Affection by a while on the surface. Uh, after the Moonlord has been defeated, Astragalum has been defeated. Yeah, the item sprite breaks and becomes unusable. Locking off Astragalum. Uh, it doesn't say how to get it. Oh, it's dropped 100% by the Ascended Astral Slime. Uh, is a rare hard mode enemy that spawns in the astral infection. It can attack by blah 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 blah. So yeah. That's us going to AFK in the astral. AFK, he says. I'm looking for a slime by the name of Mickey. Oh, not close enough. Gotta get Zerg Potion. Oh, never mind. I forgot. I put it on my other tab. Ooh, yes, lots of lag. Time for mega super awesome spawn rates. Oh, there's a slime down there. Straight down. No, couldn't really see. Oh, I see. Hey, slime. He's got a lot of health. Hey, he's dead. I Teleport home. Did you pick up all the drops? I picked up the one I needed. Yeah. Communicator. Calm. Okay, I'm ready. Tanny still grants high regen. Mm. I stopped lagging with that. Mm. I mean, it's not bad. Let's see. One, two, three, four. Five it takes about five seconds to fully regen a heart standing still. Not bad. Yeah. I agree. I wait. The biome. You did got to the biome. Uh, I keep teleporting back and forth. Drop off a hem. One thing real quick. Uh, Sixty-nine percent power. Can't do any more bosses with community. Okay, here he comes. Remember, uh, I don't know if it's gonna take damage or don't die. So just try not to die. Uh, I immediately took damage. All right, let's just try not to die. You do be chasing. I assume, me. I assume flawless is don't die. I am dead. God. I lost like 75% of my health on one hit. I died. Oh, he doesn't care about Iron Man. I'm teleporting back. He's coming back. Five seconds. Well, looks like we're not getting that item. Uh, we can do it again. It's fine. He is out of my attack distance, and he's not being very fair with it. It's the wrong attack. I hope he's making it. They're missing, like 90% of them are missing. Uh, they're not four fights, four fighting it up. Uh, I think the, the, like the random rounds that are shot from the Vortex Blaster are not four fighting. Like, I don't, I don't think they get aimbotted like normal. I'm dead again. 10 seconds. <laughs> Honestly, this fight for survival since he doesn't seem to care if we're not in their same biome. Oh should, my god. I'm back. I should oh try to my get his music god. box. I'm trying to get his music box. Uh, sure, I'll replace that. Homie do be hopping. Homie will not let me just live. Hey, I got a song. I died. You're out here fighting the <laughs> fight and I'm sitting here getting the song on the music <laughs> box. 10 seconds. I like him. Hey, I mean, we're we're collecting, so... Yeah. Despite how much damage he does, he's actually pretty simple with how his attacks work. I like how he's like... Yeah, he's like, he's like right under par of the uh, Inversion Light, I feel, with his attacks yeah. being sporadic. Oh. He just regenerated all of his health? Yeah. 
Is he gonna die or is it a second phase? It is a second phase. Oh my god, this is so cool! We're locked in an arena. I'm dead. This is so cool! He just one shot me. Homie's about to one shot me. Are we in an arena? Yeah, but if you leave, oh. you do die. <laughs> it looks like we gotta make a platform all the way to the top of the map. Because if it's gonna do that, then. Damn. That was pretty cool. I like that. Uh, that I, need was really get, cool. I need to get the platform thingy again. Here, I'm just gonna build arena platforms directly up. Campfire, please? <laughs> That's not gonna help much. <laughs> Why campfires? <laughs> uh, just a little extra life regen. Never hurt anybody. Oh, I got astral jelly. God damn it. Why do the bubbles immediately turn on if I turn on the. Oh, because it's a campfire and bubbles. It's stupid. The oh, I got a spawner too. Shit. I guess one of the super rare spawns spawned for me. I don't even have a camp. I have a campfire buff. Cozy fire. Yeah. Campfire. Life regen slightly increased. It's not going to do much, but. A little better than none. That was a cool boss. I wonder if it's like, if you die and I don't die, if I'm able to get the thing from the bag. Perhaps. Like the a specific bag drops that says, uh, well actually it's probably, if I had to make my best guess, it's probably inside of the treasure pod, I'd imagine. Okay, I have built platforms to the top of the world. I am ready when you are. I have to go all the way back down to spawn him. This is not the right biome. Astral. Here it comes. In case you didn't notice, when he does that large slam downward, he, uh... He... Oh, he immediately goes to the second phase. Cool. That's awesome. So it remembers. Ooh. I'm still almost about to die instantly, though. Oh, and now we're moving. Where even is he? Oh, there he is. But yeah, when he does that slam down thing, uh, at least in his first phase, I'm dead. In his first phase, uh, like blades come out of the ground and hit you. Ten seconds. Honestly, this this fight's more attuned to range than it is melee. Oh yeah, ah, get back in the arena. It ran to get smaller. I'm back. Yeah, it's shrinking. It seems his looked out pretty simple. I died. I can actually use my melee weapon here. Oh, he's moving out, out of the arena. Oh, we're yeah. good. We're good. Oh, I need you to stop moving like that. Nine. So I can my melee attacks on you. Oh, he's doing the Invisible. anime dash moment. Fuck you! I'm moving. We no longer have platforms. I have a flying That's mount. <laughs> Good luck, brother. <laughs> I have a flying mount. Oh, my thing. flying mount no longer flies. It has a limit. I, I need to equip the UFO. Ten seconds. If I can at least respawn before you die, he'll come rushing over there. I have to get my UFO, though, if I'm going to fight this fight. I'm going to die. Oh, he's moving towards me. What? What is it? What is it called? Uh, something key. There it is. Cosmic key. He's gone. Damn. Yeah, I, I can't do that without flying. I can't fly it forever. I have the witch's room. Yeah. I just the UFO key is pretty nice. I had it, but I swapped it out for my little melee dog thingy, Jiggy. Here we go. Okay. Instant second phase. It's very nice they do that. I wonder if he resets if he dies in this second phase to the point where we have to perfect him again. Yeah, I mean, I'd imagine so. Ow. Pretty oh. sure since they know it's kind of a little difficult that, uh... I can't even attack with most of my attacks. I'm dead already. Yeah, he's another one of those bosses that stays away. I don't have that many, like, aim assist weapons. I only have one. I'm back. I died. I'm here. 
Yes, continue to shrink so that you can't run away from my melee attacks. <laughs> this fight's hard. <laughs> I like this it. is actually a challenging fight. Yeah, it's a good, good one though. It's not just like meaninglessly fucking stupid hard. It's like, wow, this is actually a challenge. Damn it! And damn it! I'm not dodging most of these attacks. Oh, dead again. Ten seconds. Five seconds. Back. I don't like it that he converts his little forms though. It's kind of neat. Ow. That's hard to fucking dodge. It shows where it's that gonna be preemptively. I know. Die, die. <laughs> Damn it, I don't like how he shoots other projectiles that don't have little showy where you go beams. Five seconds. Three. Oh, what is this? Two, oh, it bends. Oh, that's so cool! <laughs> UFO time. Oh, I teleported instead. Back. I can't move faster than his beams. I neither could I. I died. It's, I, te I, died. I teleported away instead of using my UFO because the keys were beside each other. How is someone supposed to wall as him? Better weapons. He probably dropped some pretty yeah, good stuff. I mean, you can't fight him after. Well, yeah, you can. You have to kill him before you kill Moon Lord. In order to fight him again. Well, no, it says just after Moon Lord is killed, is his spawning weapon, or his spawn just doesn't do anything. That's what the wiki said, oh. anyway. So basically, this is our only time to ever fight him. After Moon Lord, he is inaccessible. I'll read it again. I love almost dying to fucking Mothron. Oh, oh, it's the, yeah, then let me turn it off. There, it's off. Uh, Astro Communicator, after Moon Lord has been defeated, if, okay, yeah, it says if he hasn't been defeated, the item sprite will break, but it doesn't say. Yeah. Unless he's killed beforehand, this item will no longer function when Moon Lord is Yeah. Well, we can just farm after Moon Lord then, after we kill him once. Okay, I think I'm, I think this is a certified gonna need my... My... Pull out all the stops moment. Nah, I'm gonna need my elementals for healing. I give up my defic ammo though, which regenerates health and reduces reduce the cooldown of my healing potion. I'm, I'm gonna take off my true melee stuff because I'm not actually able to hit it very often. Are you ready? Hello? Hey. You ready? Yeah. Let me see what my bow does. Probably shit damage, but... <sighs> oh yes, immediately makes arena small so that I take almost all of health from the loss. I kind of ran ah, into you with Stay away from me! Sorry. <laughs> I, I take no consideration for your survival when I'm trying not to die, I'll be real with you. I know. I tunnel vision. I know. And it's if just... I was getting chased by a bear too, I'd probably try to trip you. <laughs> it's survival of the fittest during this fight. Two, one. I'm dead. Oh, perfect timing. Ten seconds. Five seconds. Go get back in the arena! Three, you should, two, you should have a dash. I do. I died. I'm back. Oh, it teleports you into the arena if you're outside, but you're close enough. <laughs> I wish that fucking happened for me. <laughs> well, like, if, if you weren't Five in seconds. the arena initially, is what I mean. Three, two, you're gonna have one. to hover as soon as you get here. Use your mount thingy. Because he's currently in a no platform spot. Still hits the ground, even though there's no ground to hit. Yeah. I gotta use my throwing knives. This is my. Oh, I'm not fast enough in the UFO. God damn it. I 
dead, by the way. Ten seconds. Drinky time. Five seconds. Three, two, try to. I don't know if we can control which way he goes, but if you can, try to like nudge to the left. That's where the platforms are. I don't think we can. I died. I'm gonna try. If I get up here. Oh wait, we have unlimited flying. What do you mean? We have unlimited flying. Look at the flying bar. It's blue, and it's infinite. During this boss fight. Cool. Yeah. So fuck the UFO. Don't need it. We're taking a lot of damage though. Me when I show up, already about to fucking die. Yeah. <laughs> I'm. I died. <laughs> this this is crazy. Okay, so maybe it's actually better that we don't have platforms. And if we can fly infinitely, I feel like pl no platform would be better, wouldn't it? I mean, platforms really aren't bothering us because the second we get in the air, it's like fuck the platforms. Try again. Try try again. Oh. it's gonna be like three episodes of us <laughs> trying to do this one boss. Yeah, you can just skip. It's fine. I'm not going to. This is a this is a tried and true good boss fight. I like it. This isn't from any calamity either. This is from cat, uh, cattle, really a catalyst. Yeah. Just this is like, this is usually calamity's field of expertise. Bomb ass boss fights like this. I'm dead. What the fuck? I have zero health, but I'm not dead. I shall take advantage of this. I died. One of your accessories probably catch you alive or something. See, there's a good little time frame where we can come back in, even when we're all dead. Because, like, that was like five seconds of him just bullshitting. Make sure you heal up at the at the nurse before you spawn too. I don't know. You should have, have... Did you never use the uh, Dragon Sage's pet item to be able to fully be fully healed whenever you respawn? I mean, I don't keep it equipped. You don't have to. You just have to have it in your hot bar. Right click it, and it applies the buff to you permanently. It's like well, go, then go in. Do I have to do that every time I spawn in? No, you just permanently. Like use it once, it's done. Go to your, go to the storage, grab it. Dragon. Out. I don't think dragon. it's. I don't know if it's called dragon. It's it says summons the dragon sage. One second, I'll figure out what it's called. It's called. Actually, it's in the chest. It's in the pet chest. It looks like a little cardboard box. It's in one of the chests, I should say. Uh, it is here. I haven't found it. Put that on your hot bar, and then right-click with it, and you'll hear a noise. Been blessed by the third sage. Yeah. Now you can just get rid of it. Yeah. Now, whenever you respawn, you respawn with full life. Nice. Yeah. We'll start as soon as you get here. Oh, no. I just wasted my dodge immediately because I was itching my nipples. What? <laughs> I was itching my nipples and I immediately got hit, which wasted my dodge. Ow. Hey, whoa, 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 whoa. Those things at the bottom deal a fuck up damage, dude. A horribly large amount of damage. But you were actively following me. <laughs> I'm actively trying not to die. I'm dead. Ten seconds. Five seconds. Stop. The anime quick scope me. You know how it goes. I might be able to get back in time. I did not get back in time. This is your. He's still here. No, oh, he's gone. He's still here for me. Omi is. Because you haven't quote unquote died for me yet. Oh, he respawned on my screen. Yeah, I was about to say, he's, he's here. There's no border border for me anymore. Really? I, yep, I go as far as I want. Take advantage! He's not here for me. Yeah, he is. Yeah, he's just under the map. Sorry. In the ground. Yeah, there's no border for me. <laughs> Take advantage, Draven. I will stay in the border and fight from afar. This is 
is a game of survival now. Oh, he's invincible. He is all over the place. Yeah, my screen, he, he was gone. Like, he despawned entirely. For me, it didn't even show you that you were dead, so he was just, like, running around jumping. I died. You died? Yeah, I died. You did. You didn't die on my screen. Ten seconds left. I'm gonna die. Oh, you're here. Oh, it's Five moving seconds. really fast. Oh, you just died. I'm back. There's still no border. Oh, he's doing the, the... I can just stand away from it since I get outside the border. So I'll just sit out here. You're just hovering in the air for... Oh, it doesn't show it on my recording, but it shows it in my game. Oh, yeah. I'm what? outside the okay. border right now, attacking him. Oh, here he comes. Alright, the fight starts again. I really like the telegraphing. Oh, I got adrenaline. That's first. Too bad I didn't get to use it since he wasn't here. Oh, he's actually standing still. I can use my special weapon. Might do a lot of damage, but take a lot of damage with him. Hey, I'm reserving dead. my health right now, so yes, do it. I'm dead. You're still alive for me, so I'm gonna use that to my advantage. Ten seconds. You have like one health on my screen. You're dead. He died. He He's left. gone now. No. Oh no. Oh. Uh, here, let me. I want to pause my recorder real quick and switch to the uh, real internet. Home bros and giga gags. I said gags. Not gay, so they can't get in mad at me. Giga Gage. Pretty funny too. Using a different weapon this time, so hopefully it does a lot of damage. I hope so. He is invincible. Yeah, during that he is. No! God damn dude, those fucking little mini slimes he throws out deal immense damage. He just deals immense damage. Five seconds. And my, my, uh, my DPS is just shit regardless. Well, you're using, like, one of the most inaccurate guns in the game. Well, I just mean he moves so fast, A, I can't keep up with, B, I have to use glorified bullets. Uh, and then C, I, like, my max DPS is, like, 25 and a half. See with if all the my mega shark goes into. See if you can get something in the mega shark upgrade wise. I already turned it into the mega shark turns into the megalodon, and it was trash. I mean, I could whip it out again, but well, I'm just thinking if you're nowhere rate of fire. near progression. Why do those things never fucking go away? How am I meant to deal with this? Oh well, he's on his way. I think. He's gone. Is there like some OP weapon I'm not seeing? <laughs> Are you following just... the progression guide and wearing exactly what it tells you to? Yeah! Of course I am. You should have the Astro Blast for Astro Bow, Electric, Spear Launcher, that's ass. Phantasma makes sense. Plague Tainted SMG. Vortex Popper. Do you have the I have Plague the Reaper armor? No, I have the Hydrothermic. How much was the, was the Plague Bearer, Plague Reaper armor better? No. That's why I never made it. Probably because you're supposed to have Plague Reaper armor with the Plague Hive using the Plague Tainted SMG. Because they all go in conjunction with one another. If you look at the little icon beside it, it has the Omega icon. That means they're supposed to be done in conjunction. That makes them really strong. So you use Icar arrows with Plague Hive, with Plague Reaper armor, with the Plague Tainted SMG, or the Vortex Popper. Or the Phantasma. There's all sorts of stuff that's in conjunction with one another. Started by the way. No oh, shit, I was not yeah. paying attention. Sorry, I wasn't. I realized you weren't after I'd already started it. No, it's too late at that point. You gotta be skilled for this shit. We're doing exponentially worse the more we go. Five 
five seconds. And back. Can it like glitch out again? <laughs> that was only because we were lagging really fucking bad. I know. I died. And the arena gets like five times bigger the second I die. Five seconds. He's nowhere near me. Rage. Potion. This little circle aura is one of my items, by the way. You get like some life reach and shit if you touch it. You don't have to stay in it, you just need to touch it at least once. You'll get it for 10 seconds. He's dead. See, when I die, oh, I'm gonna die. Uh, hmm. I might be able to get back for you. Oh, no. he left. His arena's still here, but no, he's gone, gone. Astral binoculars, summon sightseeing tour. You can see something in the distance, provide a monitor amount of light in the abyss. Hmm. What are we. Doing wrong? There's nothing we're really doing wrong. We're just it's just gonna be a battle of attrition. Eventually we'll get it. Cool. Just learning really. I'm slowly starting to get how shit works. Slowly. Like when he does this, you just fly direct straight up. You yeah. Stay at the top. Very, very tip top, and you won't get hit by his little fucking death slimes and chunks at you. As for this shit, it's really just luck. And RNG. Just, God fucking damn it. The best thing to do that is just stay still as possible, but then he just rams into you. Hmm. I mean, yeah, in the next seven minutes, if we don't kill him, then I'll end my video and I'll play around with the plague set, but, and on a dummy. Um. Well, the dummy isn't always accurate either, because a lot of it has to do with, like, what type of enemy and the debuffs and stuff, because dummies don't really, like, dummies and debuffs usually don't properly act on each other. I know, but if it's at least, you know, does something better than what I'm currently doing, then... Because I test all my weapons on the dummy. Uh, to determine whether I use them or not. That was almost the best. Rage. Quit smacking on me like there's some fucking hooker. Get smacked on, beat down. I'm like, God damn it, dude, he's beating on my dick. 10 seconds. That's a bad thing? Yeah. I'm dead. Five I know where I'm starting this shit. I can probably get in for your despawns. I'm here. There is a just a minor sec. I drank my potion as soon as I got here. That was a mistake. I had full health already. Now the arena is so much fucking bigger. Yeah, it does now that, that periodic. dead. Because it shrinks down to a minimum size and then. No, I mean like it is like screen size bigger now and not like half of the screen. Doesn't make sense, but like all of his attack like th I feel like it bugs out and the arena is a little smaller than it actually needs to be. I'm pretty sure it just gets progressively larger as he goes through his phases. It gets big and then it shrinks and then it gets big and then it shrinks. See, like right now it's shrinking. Fight me like a man. He says to the god of all slimes. 
No, we've already fought the god of all slimes. Uh, oh, no. Would you not say this man is more godly of a slime than the slime god? I'd have to say this man isn't even a fucking slime at this point. He's a slime and he literally has a little uh, angel halo. Yeah, I just saw that a second ago. Oh, wait, 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 I have a perfect weapon for this. It would deal so much damage if I was using the right weapon. I can't see my mouse though, so that doesn't help. I did a lot of damage, but I need to change my mouse color. Yeah, Scion Gang. Oh, it's Stay away from me. Yep, I did. Ah! <laughs> yeah, let me change my mouse. I can also change the size of my mouse, can I? Yeah, I can just change my UI and make it fucking massive. <laughs> and, th and then my, uh, then all of my buffs cover my entire screen. Fuck. <laughs> uh, uh, cursor. There's gotta be something. Make it bright. Make it colorful. Make it Olivia. that color. Rockers to destroy tiles with tile destroying ammo. Oh. Uh, destroys entire map during boss fight. Alright, I'm increasing my UI size and then just gonna get rid of my. It's gonna look horrible. It, it looks very bad, but I can see my mouse easier. I might zoom in a little bit too. Maybe. I don't know. Figuring stuff out as I go. <laughs> My buffs take off probably a fourth of my screen right now because of my increased UI size. I think Terraria just crashed. Is you still here? Nope. Okay. Alright, I will try to use the bow because apparently I'm supposed to have this bow at this stage, so... The Phantasma? The yeah, just don't yeah. let go of left click, it gets fast. Uh, it's good. Mm, it doesn't speed up like you think it is. It has a limit. But it does get faster. Than, you know, just regular pressing occasionally. I really wish he'd stop colliding with me when he's already doing bullet hells. Man, I, I've taken every single one of these hits so far. And we're positive you're not in death mode. Yes, Cuddy. You can see yourself. Whenever you go into your, your inventory, it says in the top right beside your health bar. Right now it's locked on Revengeance because we're in this mode, but... Or in this boss fight, I mean. I have five seconds, by the way. I'm back. I died. Oh, good in the hood. I hope so. I haven't been there in a while. He goes to his stop moving and his super spinny fucking like spin cycle mode. That's where I can deal a shit ton of damage. Three seconds. Yeah, I'm doing decent. Spin cycle? Nope, not spin cycle. Laser mode. You're getting hit by every single attack mode. I'm dead. Ten seconds. Five seconds. You should go to spin cycle soon. Here. Yep. Me dashing out of. If you want to, you can teleport home and heal. Oh, yes, yeah, yeah, spin cycle. Double. Good. This is my time for damage now that I've actually realized it. Preemptively use this weapon. Oh, I dashed. I keep accidentally dashing into attacks, I'm dead. Yep. <sighs> Fuck. I don't like auto dashing. I'm tapping because I want to go lightly in that direction over and over. I'm not tapping because I want to <laughs> fucking go at the speed of sound directly into a death beam. Can I like... Is there really like disable dashing without unequipping one of the best shields in the game? Maybe I can go into... Uh, mod configs. Let me try. Mod config. 
Calamity mod main dash. I'm at an hour right now. Default dash. Gives the player a very weak dash by default. I don't know. So it's not default. So. Yeah, I am as well. But, uh, we'll do one more fight. I mean, it's we're probably going to end up having to just record, but not actually yeah. record a video. And we just record until the fight's done, and then we yeah. put just that in the video. Because obviously I don't want to lose the fight. I don't want to not record oh, and cool. win. But also I don't want hours and hours of attempting Fighting this bastard. Yeah. yeah. The cool boss and all, but I don't feel like the audience would enjoy that very much. Me waiting multiple hours to upload multiple videos of the same boss fight? No thank you. I've used the wrong weapon. Don't forget the circle. To touch it. I'm dead. Very cool. I'm probably gonna die. I have no healing. Ooh, wow, moment. He's still fighting. He's no longer fighting. So we've got about like five seconds, even after both of us are dead, to get to the fight. Ugh. Yeah, that'll yeah, be we're gonna end my episode off there. Yep, I will as well. You can subscribe if you guys would like to see more, and I will see you in the next one. Unless you don't want to see more, and then I won't. And then I wish you well in finding something else you want to see. Hopefully from my channel. Bye-bye.